Buonasera. I extend a heartfelt welcome to everyone for our first virtual La Dolce Vita and my gratitude to our incredible head of school, Valentina Mbeni, the Consul General of Italy, Lorenzo Ortona, Maestro Carlo Dean, and our wonderful students for their contribution this evening. As always, thank you to our Board of Directors for their continued support and for helping La Scuola move forward. Most importantly, thank you to the La Dolce Vita Committee and Shannon Cleary for leading this visionary event and allowing us the opportunity to celebrate La Scuola. Right now, the world faces unprecedented challenges. At the same time, we are experiencing beautiful moments showing the resilience of the human spirits and the power of the heart. The La Scuola community has a history of stepping up in unprecedented times. In the fall of 27, students, parents, and teachers gathered blankets and food for, victim, for fire victims. And in this current crisis, La Scuola heard the call from a fellow parent, a doctor, asking for masks to protect medical personnel. This community rallied and overnight had gathered masks. In difficult moments, finding, building, and supporting community calms anxiety and rejuvenates the heart. But we don't have to find or build a community. We are the fortunate ones. Our community is here, albeit virtually this evening. For me, the community began at the preschool. Parents supported me during George's rough transition to Piccoli. Every morning he cried so hard he had to throw up. One morning, a mom calmly said, remember Spazio Gioco? Remember watching those teachers with the preschoolers? How they loved the kids, made them laugh, cheered them on. George is fine. She was there for me. The community began at the preschool, but flourishes across three campuses. When George and I had tough mornings getting out the door, my frustration evaporated when I pulled up to the curb on Fell Street and Sally smiled, opened the door, and gave a comforting look. She brightened my day. And this year we opened a new middle school campus and witnessed our community navigate a new campus, a new middle school, and a new neighborhood with curiosity, eagerness, and intention. All three campuses share a beautiful sense of community. And now, here we are, facing COVID-19. Not alone, but together. Together, we are sharing a glass of wine, enjoying our meals, and celebrating the love and support we give to each other. In the past two weeks, this community has transitioned from Italian hugs to online learning. We have watched teachers bring joy into our living rooms through computer screens. And we support our teachers, as many of them long for their families at home. And we make sure all of our students have access to the internet. From Valentina to the students, from teachers to administration, from parents to members of our Italian community, to our board of directors, the La Scuola community comforts and supports and celebrates each other. And that is what the world needs more of. So I invite you to give to fund a need. First, I give to thank the community. And second, I give for the Innovative Education, a program, whether it's in the classroom or online, that teaches students to be true thinkers and to lean into problems, not run from them. And third, and most important this evening, to share this community and to invite others to join our community through our tuition assistance program. Now, more than ever, we need to support our current and future families. Giving to fund a need is how we can open our community to others. Grazie mille.